Snug Radio's Retro Lounge, episode 75. Yes, um, tonight we're looking at Turbo Graphics um, giving it its Japanese name. PC Engine uh, is what we know it as. Um, we're going to play some games that we've never played. And at least one of them is in Japanese. Uh, so... Yes. Before we get into that, though, I thought you might like to take a look at um, a Turbo Graphics. Uh, sorry, a PC Engine. There we go. That's a, a PC Engine, and um, I took it out especially for you. And these, these are the games. The games come on little cards, um, and these look like they might need a little bit of a clean. Um, so, I do have a handheld version of this as well, and all the rest of the cards are in the stack with that. Um, it's a battery eater. But, uh, yeah, so there you go. That's what we're playing tonight. That's the, uh, the controller for it. Um, it's a similar age... <laughs> similar age to the um it's kind of just after the NES so it was supposed to be an improvement on the NES and um it was uh delayed so it ended up coming out in the states in uh it's against the um the mega drive but sort of like the next generation so it was always a little bit behind um what games are they? Uh, so, these two cards are uh, International Soccer and Ordine is the only the English uh, that I can read on it. There you go, Ordine. Um, some some Japanese game. Um, but yes, it was easy. You know, I thought. Well, I always talk about having these things, but. Uh, now I can show you. Ah. Anyway, there's enough of me being here. I need to get over there so we can look at some of these games we keep talking about. Um, and we're going to do that. And we're going to do that by going... Shoop. There we go. And if you just, just have a look there, that's the... Uh, the PC Engine. Slash Turbo Graphics. Um, I'll probably end up calling it Turbo Graphics mostly. Just so you know. Uh, so we're going to play these in um, alphabetical order. Yes. A big thank you to Nutty Cluster who subscribed again with her own hard-earned cash. 15 months. Wow. Look at that. Um, of course, you can be like Nutty Cluster if you want. If you like what you see, then uh, feel free to subscribe. I won't stop you. In fact, I actively uh, encourage it. Yes. Uh, so, we're going to start with a game called Air Zonk. Um, now, it's, I think it's been a while since we've played um, a Turbo Graphics game, so I can't remember if we have issues with the, uh, <laughs> with the controller or not. But I guess we're going to find out any minute now. So we have played... Um, a Zonk game before, but in in uh, I think in English-speaking countries it's called Bonk, not Zonk. Um, so, is that loud enough? Um, I, so, moderator extraordinaire Nutty Cluster is um, not in a place of good internet again, and. Um, may or may not be able to help us with the the audio ooh sweet spicy or bitter mode ah oh, gonna have to keep remembering that so um on this pad it's the analog sticks that move it around Posh, right? Oh, 
Okay, so we, we've got a bit of an R type game going then. So I think the last bonk game we played was uh, mo more of a platformer, like a money and jumpy, not a shooter like this. Um, and I think because we've got it on auto, it's, um, how can I not get that baby then? That bloody smiley face. Um, it's aiming for us as well, which is good. Certainly useful for me. Oh no. Was he on my side? I was avoiding him then for a minute. I thought, uh oh. There's a big blue fish cow. I've got no idea. Oh, I died. I was watching the um, low fish cow, low cowfish. If I'm being honest, it does feel like <laughs> it's as easy as I, 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 I mean, it's easy enough for me to play it, um, but it doesn't feel like it's much of a struggle either. So I'm wondering if it's um, meant for, I don't know, I was going to say meant for kids, but let's I mean, these... Oh, we were kids when these games came out. They are. They are for kids. But we have played some that have been a bloody nightmare. So... I don't know why I keep dying. Yink. Guess I've got invincibility on. Now I did uh, fill the playlist with slightly more games than I would normally play on one of these um, because we may possibly get a Japanese game that we're just going to be looking at and then go, uh, no. I'm gobsmacked and I won't be able to uh, understand what's going on. Okay, don't have enough... Uh, don't have enough to shoot everything. Oh! Ah, suddenly got more um, difficult. Look, look, there I go again. Oh. Surprised by it, even though I knew what it did. Oh. Oh dear. Yes, yes, they, I mean, it is, um, known for its cuteness. 
And look, there's even the little guy from Little Nicky there on the left, um, which you'd appreciate. Um, I don't really know whether to... Oh, let's, let's continue. I'm conscious we might skip this game which we're now out of play, move on to a game that we don't know how to play, and then go, oh, pants, I wish we'd stayed with the original one. Ah, I see, I've got a power up now, so... I'm going to get them boss people in a minute. Let's stay at this level. Move towards the middle a bit. Give us... There we go. Got him. feel um that on on tonight's episode we are going to see a, an inordinate amount of cuteness i feel it could be um cuteness city oh it's I've no idea what that guy is it looks like a dumper truck Where you need to concentrate on the path through. Ooh. So it sounds like a boss. Snakey McGee. Oh. There's a lot going on, isn't there? <laughs> if I didn't have my little green mate, I think I'd be stuffed. Like that. Oh, no. I thought it was dead. I am invincible. Until the point that I'm not. Oh! What? I have metal teeth. Okay.
Something bad's gonna happen, innit? Whoa! Yeah, I have to avoid that then. And the, the mosquitoes. Nope. How can I avoid it? Don't just shoot the shit out of it. Ah, oh. bloody sorting hat! Come on, get out of it! Oh, I shot me with a laser beam this time. I thought I got away with it too. Trying to be for those pesky kids. Jimmy. Well, I think we're probably at a point where we should stop. Um, I think it's very possible that we have an air bonk or an air something already on the uh, revisits list. Let's have a look. No, we don't. Um, I don't know. Maybe we'll just bonk again another day. That sounds fun. Uh, so that was a bonk. Um, so let's now move on to our next game, which is called B-Ball. It's B-E space ball. B-Ball. Um... I should probably tell you that the uh, criteria for picking these games was... Um, ooh, nice cover. So we are judging books by their covers tonight. Um, and we'll see if that'll bite us on the ass. Only if we ask it nicely. So B-Ball. It involves balls, one would assume. Oh. I am across Japanese man. I am telling you off and send you to the man with the animals and the gropey hands. I am the man with the gropey hands. Here are my animals. Okay, what have we got? We've got a girl that moves around. A girl who, if she had blue hair, could be Nutty Cluster. But let's not dwell on that too much. Right, so standing on there does, doesn't do anything. Doesn't do anything. So, do we interact with these balls? Okay. But if I push it there... I can't get out of them, then. I can't get out, can I? Okay. Okay, right. So, I have a ball that I need to put on that. That. And I have a ball I have to put on that. Oh. No. Come in here, bugger. I can't, I can't get the right way around on it. There we go. The slow moving hedgehog has got me. 
Nazi Nutty Cluster came to the same conclusion I did. Okay, so... Is that it? Looks like it. I'm sure that angry Japanese man is happy with my progress. Yes? Be the other. <laughs> oh. Ah, I didn't think they chased me, I just thought they were randomly rolling around. Okay. Don't stay dead for very long, do they? It never looks any happier, though. I don't want it in there, do I? Oh yeah, I suppose I could. Trap it. Oh no, I've already done that one. Jerk. like this one either. Granted, I've no idea why he's cross. Or indeed if he is cross. Oh, wrong, wrong joystick. Go and move too far down. Bit by a mutant turtle. Go 
go away. Go wasn't going away. And it was another Sonic sneaking up behind me. Because don't think I haven't noticed that uh, your hedgehogs have got blue spikes. B-ball. I'm watching you. Um, am I going to regret that? Go oh, quick, quick, quick. Get out of my way. You wee rascal. Okay, mm. what level was that? That was was that level five that we've just done. Oh, that was a question, wasn't it? I think I answered yes. Ooh, right. Nope, nope. Okay, now we uh, have to go oh, this way. Ah, uh, shit. I need to get around that pole. No, no, no. Wrong way. <sighs> no, stop it. Oh, little girl. Oh, is it times on this? Oh, no. Didn't realise there was a time limit. Microphone's covering the bottom of the screen. I just couldn't see it properly. Okay, let's try again. Jackass! Stop it! Ah! You... Well, there we go. B-ball. Um, that feels like a game that I might just just play on my own. You know, one afternoon. Um. Anyway, there you go. Ball. So let's have another look. At, uh, not another look. Let's have a look at uh, our next game. Our next game is called Kadash. Ooh, title, title game. Um, I've got no, I've no idea. I don't even know why I'm going. Oh, and Kadash is going to be this because I've no idea. No idea. Princess Sarasa. Sarasa. Oh no. Without doing any other thing, doesn't this feel a little bit um, gauntlety? I wonder if I can get that screen any larger for you. Oh, it, it'll do. 
I'm not messing around. Um, so, one player, select a character with the right joystick, of course. Oh, which, well, he's the first one. We should start with him, shall we? Don't know why I'm bothering. supposed to fight those people, am I? I, I mean, is there a... Jump? There's only jump or sword. There isn't a talk button. Nope. It's just pause. See, why are they all stood around, though? You, it's almost like... Oh, you, you must be there for a reason. We play in Castlevania. I think we are. Oh. woman because she's got a crack cracking set of eyes on her aren't she he Jump because I got oh, sake. Look, every time I jump it. Oh. Thank God for that. Didn't think I was gonna get out. Oh, I'm not doing because I'm being stupid. Skeletons or die. And drops you right back to the start. Pressing the run button. Okay. We'll play it. Um You see. That's really a lady. And I know that's a lady. And that fighter, that fighter is not a lady. But, dude looks like a lady. But this lady looks like a lady. I wonder how she's gonna actually look in the, um, in the game. Just 
Story, story, story. Story, story, story. More story. Story. See, look, now we've got a Castlevania style whip. I just feel a little bit like, why? Why did I have to go through those three or four screens to get to the caverns? These are some bats. Bats in a minute. Oh. No, no. Time's it. As soon as you get off there, hoofs you with a bat. Oh, it's a bit boring for Nutty Cluster. When we die, we will stop playing it. Come on, I'm hitting him. Look, 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 look. See? Dead. There you go, Kadash. Now listed as a game we have played on Retro Lounge. Yeah. What's that music you can hear? Oh, oh, it's not our next game. No, no. Um, our next game is called Dragon Egg! Exclamation mark. It should be noted that there's a definite, definitive exclamation mark in this game's name. And it's in Japanese. I'm sure it's a super interesting story. assumes that's the Japanese for dragon oh no we could be Zelda in this shit okay we've got some cuteness we've got a jump and a hit things Point of the game to get as far as you can. Oh, it's to go to the shed. Oh, want to buy stuff? No, nope, no thanks. No, nope, no thanks. I'm just here to chew bubble gum and hit skeletons. Can 
I not hit him a ball? Right. Nope. Oh, just doesn't have a lot of life left, does she? That's a cool little animation. Just uh, dropping off the ledge. Oh, little skip off. Okay, so what's its purpose? What what are we supposed to be? Yeah, bastard. Oh! Yes, we're continuing. Of course we're continuing. to get him, don't you think? Well, not like that. Probably die with a second attempt. Beat the shit out of him like that. So what's along here then? Oh, right. This is probably the way to go. I think I should have probably just moved straight away. Things falling out from under your feet. Oh. 
No, you can't walk on the red stuff. I wonder if there's an English version of this where you can um, like see what's in the shop and stuff. Quite enjoyed its cuteness. Um, I do feel I'm probably <laughs> not the right player for that. Um, but that was Dragon Egg. And as always with these episodes, if if we're playing a game, I'm playing a game, and you've been liking it and you want to see it again, then you can message us on. We've got a Facebook page. Messages on Facebook. Or um, drop us an email, retro at snugradio.co.uk. We're very easy to get hold of. You can tweet us. You can X us on X. Um, and just let us know, and we'll add it to the revisit list. Or we may even, if we get enough of them, we may add it to the audience request episode. Um, but for now, that was Dragon Egg on the Turbo Graphics. Um, okay, now we're going to the uh, we're, we're going to the one that I thought was the most ostentatiously Japanese. Um, I, I suspected the others might have some Japanese in, but we'd be able to play them, which is is what happened. Um, but this one actually has a Japanese title, and it's called Fushigi no Yuma no Alice, and I picked it. Not to make things difficult for myself, really, but I know that Naughty Cluster is a, uh, an Alice in Wonderland fan, and it appears to be some game based around that. Who knows? But we'll know in a second when we crack it open and have a look. I mean, one would hope that at least one of you out there would be reading this and understanding it. Um. Oh, don't remember that from Wonderland. Look, let's um, let's press that. Seems really, really quiet to me, that one. I'm just going to have to turn it up a little bit. Apologies. Oh, the forest. Oh, he's, look, cute. We've got a jump and a fire, like all the other games we've played so far. You jive turkey. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Right, my fire is not very responsive. Ah, oh, it's because it's right. Well, this, this, Naughty Cluster, I see you in the chat. This, this is Alice. I would like my fire button to be like when I fire. To actually fire. Look, I'll be honest, my Alice in Wonderland knowledge is not... I know a bit about it. I have seen a few Alice in Wonderlands. Don't remember any turkeys, though.
Whoa, 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 whoa. Nope. Oh, you jackass. No, you can't just drop off there then. What am I supposed to do? There we go. I think I'm just going to keep running, keep running, keep running. Oh, I recognise these guys. Can't shoot them all. Oh, it didn't put me back at the start. That's nice. Come on now. Shouldn't be this difficult. Can I not kill him? Because it shouldn't be that difficult, but it bloody is. in doubt, run away from the man throwing spears. Oh, and get spiked by a spiky spiker. Oh, no. Oh, it needs, needs two, does it? Ah, bloody... Still bloody got me. Fuck off. When he goes blue when I hit him, you'd think I'm getting him. Oh, fuck. He does die then. It just takes ages. Oh, that's a hard turkey. Are slowing down. Oh, fuck off.
No. No, we're not. No. Continuing. No, no. Ah, well, there you go. That was Fushugi no Yumi no Alice. Some form of Alice in Wonderland game. Uh, okay, so. Uh, I only started half the games because I wasn't sure exactly what we'd have ahead of us. So let's start the rest of them. And you never know, we might get through 10 games tonight. Seeing as we're halfway through both the number of games and the, um, the time. Uh, okay, so, right. Our next game is going to be Hatteras. Spelt like Tetris, but with hat in front of it. Okay. Oh. Oh, I don't know. Just, just play. Um. So it's. <laughs> it is. Um. <laughs> Tetris, but with hats. And I'm not sure I can change the size of them. How do I, am I supposed to make a shape? Oh, so that one changed around. Right, looks like we're losing Nutty Cluster for the evening. What a shame, but she will insist on going to the caravan. Um, well, thank you for the time that you were here, Nutty Cluster. Um, I'll see you Wednesday. Fire. Does that burn all the hats? Yes, it does. Of course it does. I mean, one assumes at some point it's going to be more than two hats coming out. Button. Is that a, a bad thing? I don't know. I don't know if the flames are a bad thing or a good thing. I think they might be bad because you don't get points. Maybe. Oh, I didn't do that. Have to get my thumbs right on the analog stick, else it's going to uh, push it over the over the edge. It's going to push me over the edge. I mean, I don't, it doesn't seem, uh, I hate to say it, it doesn't seem difficult enough. There's no L shapes or any of the, the like, Tetrino shapes.
And I can see that it's putting up different um, hats and making it more difficult for me to get a stack right. And I can see what it's doing. Choices, choices. <laughs> so the fire then does the fire. all of the same colour so if it's a different hat it's um, ah, shit. it stops Getting rid of that middle middle stack. Well, I don't know what happened there. It's obviously against the clock because uh, I hadn't even looked properly. Oh, shit. little game. I mean, I don't, I don't dislike it, but it's just... Who, who thought just the two hats? I don't, I don't know. And maybe it's because I'm playing it on easy. No, oh, sod chops. Oh, now I've got no blues. Um, choices, choices.
do with dropping a, a flaming fireball onto one of those stacks of hats somewhere. That middle stack. feeling we might just have to stop playing this because um, it could just go on and on although we're still not we're still on stage one The whatever those hats are. Oh, now I've got to. So then, we need to clear eight more hats. Is that what I'm reading? Does that make sense? Looks like it, doesn't it? Didn't want to put that there. Oh, is it eight more stacks of hats? Yeah, it's stacks of hats. That's why it's taking so freaking long. Stacks of hats. It's all gone Pete Tong, hasn't it? Oh, uh, oh, uh. That did nout. I don't know what the sale thing was, I don't know what I just did, but I've got an extra hat now. Um, but do you know what? Oh. I think we're going to stop there. Yes. That was Hattress! A, a really simple Tetris? Yeah, weird, weirdy, weirdy, weird. Uh, okay, let's move on um, to New Adventure Island. Like I say, I picked these for um, cute boxes, I think. But looking at this, I don't know. Spot too soon. Feels like Wonder Boy to me. Oh, 
Oh, this isn't Wonder Boy related. I'd be very surprised. Wonder if it was called that in a uh, in Japan. Oh, okay. Can't do that. Second, um, yes, that's a confirmation that um, Naughty Cluster uh, is no longer with us. Dog jumping frog. I mean, uh, just funny. What happened? Jumping too early, aren't I? I'm invincible. It does. Oh no, come back. I liked that fairy. What was that? What was that? I thought it was clear. So when you kill these snakes, they just die. So, I need to pay attention to what will kill me, don't I? Oh, 
So there's something along here. As soon as it's given me the um, boomerang, because I need it. No! Not much got my edge in, mate, have I? Let's get this a bit closer. again. Oh. Okay. Okay. Well, that was New Adventure Island. Surely, surely part of the Wonder Boy series. Or stolen from it, if not. Um, okay, shall we move on? We're moving on to the S's now. And we're going to play a game called Sidearms. Hyperdyne sidearms, if you prefer. Uh, okay. Oh, oh no. Something bad's happened. Ah, wrong joystick. Oh, I see. Shit. I want to fire backwards after I press the other button. And it's not auto fire. Oh, yummy cow. these guys. <laughs> I'm going to dislike that noise. Wow! Okay. 
So now we see if there's any settings. There are no settings. We're so screwed. Joystick again. Fuck no. Fuck no. Fuck. Oh, fuck this. Well, there you go. That was sidearms. Made for somebody with faster reactions than I've got. I can tell you. Um, wow. Holy moly. Um, let's move into our last two games for tonight. We're going to play the next one is The Legendary Axe. When you want to ax a question, this is the one you need to use. Um, okay. Oh, I don't think we'll be playing this very long. It looks rubbish. And he's quite slow in his reactions when he fights. I, I want a fast shooter. Jumper. Don't know what those things were, but I'm sure they were useful. Now I have to go back. Oh, what? Come on, come back. Oh, I see. It's like that, is it? And I have to kill him to... Do I have to kill him? Nope, I'm gonna die. But I can't reach the rope. shame because I think I'd realised how to kill it. Yeah, 
Yeah, yeah, piss face. <sighs> That's probably enough legendary axe for my liking. Can't see it. It's been one that I'm going to rush back to. Um, so, then let's take a look at our final game tonight. And um, the intro screen has a little bit of Japanese on it. So, who knows? Um, this is called Tricky. of numbers okay oh, now what okay so Right, what am I supposed to be doing? I'm obviously going to regret kicking these animals around. I, I might. Okay. Um... Do I need? Not well, I've booked that, haven't I? If I need to move that lion, buggered, buggered, shit. This is where Naughty Cluster would have been useful. Um, I feel we probably should get the animals together, perhaps. I mean, oh, oh, hello. All right, all might not be lost. Oh, all is lost because I've seen matey squirrel over here and I can't, I'm not going to be able to get him. Yeah. Let's have, a look. Let's have another go. Now we know what we're doing. So, right. Do they have to be... Can they be... They can't be next to each other, can they? Because that, that didn't work. So how am I supposed to move that squirrel without kicking it flat against the bloody... Right, so if we kick that one and kick that one, I'm going to wish I'd not done that either, I imagine, but I think we can do that. And we can come back here and do that. But now we have these little bastards and I can't move them. So... We need the ones from the middle. Right. Yeah, yeah. Come on, we have to do at least one, don't we? So, that squirrel. And that squirrel. Right. So, for now, can we get rid of the squirrels? Ooh. Right, so, 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 so. What is going to stop the squirrel? What's going to stop the other squirrel from moving? 
Uh, well, whatever move I make is going to be wrong, innit? Thing is, for my cunning plan to work. Oh no, no, okay. Right, so. Even at this time of night. Ah, thank goodness. Thank freaking goodness. Right, what we're gonna do now. If I... Oh, I can't kick. So I have to kick him upwards. Or downwards. Thing is, if I... Uh... Nope, it has to go. Oh, Jesus. Oh, and I've trapped myself in. Shy talk. Um. Okay. chat that cat in the top and I won't be able to move it then. Or the squirrel. Shit. See, I need something here. Actually, to be fair, I need something. There. You know what? It's tricky. It is. It's tricky at this time of night. So um, instead, instead of being tricked, I'm um, I'm gonna say that's the end of this episode. We're done. We're done. Um, besides, Nutty Cluster's left. Uh, so. If we're at the end of the episode, and I do realise there's one one of you, there is another of you watching, so hello, um, and goodbye, as it turns out. But um, let's have a look at the wheel. Now, it's looking a little sparse, so it might be getting to the point that we're going to add things back onto it again. Um, and, of course, if you have any idea, any ideas, suggestions, maybe for what could go on the wheel, then um, you can email us. Uh, but let's give it a spin and see what we're doing uh, next week. More Japanese! Yes. Um, we're going to be playing games from the Neo Geo Pocket and the Neo Geo Pocket Colour. A super little handheld. Um, I may even dig it out and show you it, because I've got one. Uh, so, right, okay. It sounds like fun to me. Um, 
the Neo Geo Pocket. Well, again, a lot of the ch a lot of the games potentially Japanese. Um, it's not unplayed either. This is just uh, I wanted to feature the the Pocket because it's kind of cool. It's it's a good little handheld. Um, back from back in the day. So um, there you go. So I'll mention the number of times if you want to email us, you can do. And that's the email address, retro at snugradio.co.uk, retro at snugradio.co.uk. That is also the um, the website, snugradio.co.uk. Um, we're also everywhere as Snug Radio. We're on, um, well, if you're watching this video on YouTube, why not join us on a Monday night? Uh, see it live on Twitch at Snug Radio. If you're watching it on Twitch live now, there's a slick edited version on YouTube. Uh, we're on YouTube at Snug Radio. But we're also on Facebook. We've got a Facebook page called Snug Radio. And you can contact us on that. Uh, we're on Twitter, X Twitter uh, at Snug Radio. And TikTok at Snug Radio. Like I say, everywhere at Snug Radio. Um, we also have um, both I and Nutty Cluster have design shops Nutty Cluster's called Ink Inspiration and I'm called The Glorious Idiot and you know why not let you know we might put some retro lounge merch on The Glorious Idiot at some point um, so keep your eyes open um, I will put a Put a web address on on the link and put it in show notes so you can easily uh, get to it but that's it from me um i've been math have a great week this has been snug radio's retro lounge play something retro goodbye